If you are watching this video, you most likely are on your own fitness journey. In my six years of training, I've made some mistakes that I now look back on and regret. There are simple mistakes that could have been avoided if I had a little bit more knowledge. Here are six of my own mistakes, so you don't have to do them. The first mistake I made is something you guys at home are actually not doing, which is seeking more information. My first year of training, I did not know what I was doing and therefore did not really make any improvements. Then I started watching other YouTubers that are further in their fitness journey than me and learn from their trials and errors. The more information you have, the better you will become at problem solving, like knowing what exercises best fits your body and how to properly perform different movements and exercises. So keep watching YouTube videos on how to train and diet the right way so you can make progress way faster. The second mistake is something that I regret since I became a YouTuber, which is not taking more progress pictures. Because I was so skinny, it was hard for me to take pictures of myself because I did not like the way I looked. Old school bodybuilders like Arnold Schwarzenegger used to be fanatics about taking pictures because they would expose you weak points. Making progress is about being objective when looking at your own body and then making improvements based on your own weak points. So keep taking pictures even though it might seem difficult in the beginning when you don't like the way you look. The next mistake I made actually ties back to the first point I made, which is not using correct form. Improper form can lead to injury and also can prevent you from getting the full benefits of the exercise. It's important to learn the proper form for each exercise and use it consistently. By using improper form, you can actually make less progress because the given muscle is not fully targeted. By watching tutorials on how to perform exercises, you will not make this mistake and reap the full benefits of any given exercise. The fourth mistake I made is something that I did until recently and many people still do, which is not feel your muscle when you do a given exercise. Whenever you train your chest or your back, for example, you need to feel that muscle activated throughout the entire range of motion. In the beginning when I worked out, I just did bench press for example, but didn't really feel my chest. A good solution to this problem is pre-exhaust sets. Pre-exhaust sets are sets you do before your actual workout in which you do a lot of repetitions so you get as much blood into your chest or your back or any muscle as possible so when you go to your bigger lifts you feel your muscle activated. The fifth mistake I made is something everyone told me not to do, which is doing too much too early. When you start working out, you're so motivated, you just wanna to go to the gym every day and lift as much weight as possible, but that can work against you. In the beginning, it's not about weight, it's not about how often you go, it's about when you go that you do the right things. You need to use the right form and feel your muscle whenever you train it. Being highly motivated as a beginner is a good thing, but like I said before, it can work against you. Like I said in the beginning, make sure you do as much research as possible. You don't want to go to a gym like I did and waste your time for an entire year until you realize you did the wrong thing. So slow down and give yourself a break. The sixth mistake I made is something that I figured out recently and I truly changed, which is having fun when you go to the gym. Fitness should also be about having fun. Don't stress yourself out in the first year by doing too many exercises and going to the gym too often. Fitness should be part of your life forever. So make sure you find the right balance between putting in the work and having fun. And if your workout program isn't fun, then switch it up. Life is too short. Fitness is a marathon. So figure out a way you can make it fun for yourself. And that's it. That's six mistakes I made in my fitness journey. So you don't have to do them. Let me know if you made any mistakes that I didn't speak about so others can learn from those as well. Thank you guys for watching. There will be two to three videos every week on my channel. So like and subscribe for more fitness related content.